Greetings and welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It is yours truly, the crypto enthusiast, Light Liger here once again. And today, we're going to be looking into a crypto mining software called Kudo Miner that allows you to mine both with your CPU and also with your GPU. And it's a very user-friendly program. It's really made for beginners. And the thing is, there might be even 30 to 40% people in crypto who don't even know what their seed phrase is or private key. And these are not really, all of the people who have invested in crypto are not really tech savvy people. How many of that 100% of the people who have invested in crypto actually know how to mine? I don't, <laughs> I think not really that many. So it's very important for mass adoption to get people to understand the systems and make it really easy as possible. I mean, you have Electronium, they did their phone app, which does simulated mining, and it's just two clicks and it's already mining. That's how easy every miner basically should be. And when you like run on these like, you know, professional mining things, you have to edit the notepad files. You got to benchmark things. Sometimes the benchmarking is automatic, obviously. And then you have to like choose the pools and everything. There's a lot of like loops that you have to go through. It's not the most simple process out there. And obviously there are different level of, you know, mining programs out there. Some are more automatic and some are more, you know, it allows you to customize further. But Kudo Miner essentially is mining to their uh, own like base of source where you withdraw the money instead of like through miners where the kind of coins are on the pool and then sent to your own wallet. So I, I kind of like the idea of Kudo Miner in that sense that it's very user friendly. It's really easy to get into. And it also allows, as I said, to mine with both of your GPU and also with your CPU. And also like in general, if you were like doing a new crypto project, like a new coin or something, I would do a really, really easy miner for it, which everybody else could use because that could really much easier lead to increase the mass adoption for that coin because it's easier to mine. Like sometimes people are just going to give up halfway through setting up their own miner. They just don't want to be bothered with it. So let's get into Kudo Miner, which is, as I said, it is a very user-friendly interface and everything. Basically, you install it, and then you have to obviously whitelist it on your uh, virus programs because they, every like antivirus program is saying that every uh, crypto thing related thing is malware, which is absolutely ridiculous. And I was one of the early adopters, so I actually got a bit of a Satoshi when I signed up. I think you can still get 5,000 if you do. And I recommend you sign up through my referral link. So even if you're not going to be mining, maybe you know a friend who is going to, and maybe you can refer to them to actually mine on the platform and you will get 10% uh, of their earnings. And if they refer another person, you get 5% of that. So that's actually a pretty cool deal there, just so you know. And there's a lot of settings inside, you know, the Kudo Miner. So there's CPU enabled, you can disable it. How much GPU you want to actually use? We're going to be going with 85% once we're going to be starting it. And pause when computer in use, scheduled use, launch on startup, earn when started, third-party miners, overclocking, algorithms. There's a lot of that here. A lot of the more pop popular um, mining algorithms are out there, which is nice. And there's also BLC transactions and devices. Let's go into those a bit. So here we have the transactions of the mining revenues, referral commissions, they are all... I don't understand why they have to be externalized in the website, why they can't be showing on the miner itself. And it has devices here, the windows and everything and status. And that's real nice that you can actually observe things and you can see the referrals here and what they have mined and everything like that. Uh, there's users, emails, and also you, this is where you also uh, withdraw the money. So where is it withdraw? I always have a hard time finding it. But we, we basically, it's it's that difference from a lot of other miners is that they, they go straight to your pool or they go straight to your wallet. So you withdraw from here. There's a 5% mining fee and 1.25% uh, withdrawal fee. The withdrawal fee is not really that bad. And I would argue that also because the Kudo Miner actually finds the most cheapest coin to mine 
So basically, you can get a lot more better return than using a command line miner, for example, at least what they claim on their website. So basically, that 5% is not really that much, and the withdrawal fee is not even that much either, unless you'd want to withdraw every day or something like that. So we're going to be um, using, so I guess a bit about the coins. Right now, there are four coins. They started with Bitcoin only, so they have increased... Bitcoin, Ethereum, Monero, and Ravencoin. Ravencoin has become very, very popular as of late. I mean, I throw 20 bucks and bought some Ravencoin because I believe it will double that amount in a year or two. It's becoming a very, very popular project. And GPU selection also, and we're going to put that automatic. And maybe in future, they're going to be adding a lot more of these um, mining options in the platform, 100%, I believe so. And that is a good thing if people want to mine a different different coin i don't know if there's like a voting process how do they choose things maybe you can write to them maybe you can send them suggestions i don't know but we're going to be ena enabling the miner usually when you do it first time it's actually um doing the benchmarking that might take two minutes or something and it's it seems to be um you know like now 70 73 hashes per second that's not very much to be honest but we're not running it on 100 percent here obviously and gpu is not actually mining right now because well i don't actually know why it's not mining right now i think i've um if we change it to ethereum i think it will so one thing that i, I do want to acknowledge here that it's Make sure to whitelist it on your uh, antivirus software because it might affect on what access does it have. Let's try to actually get the GPU. Oh, now the GPU is actually starting, so it says here. So the CPU starts to mine much, much, much easier and much faster. And basically, it's obviously, if you're going to be running on Macs, it's going to slow your computer down. Don't play games while you do it, etc. And... It, overall, I think it's a pretty nice program. Obviously, there's other alternatives like Honeyminer and Cryptex. Going to be reviewing those in a couple of days. But, but, but out of the all three, I would say the Kuno Miner is the most versatile because I think those other two only allow you my Bitcoin as of right now. And it's a, it's a very, very easy way to get into crypto mining, even if you don't want to mine for long term or something like that. I think it's useful to understand how the process works and what are like good hash rates and everything like that. So you can understand. And it's kind of cool to be part of the mining process in terms of collective sense. It's, there's something inherently cool about it. But overall, Kudo Miner is a nice earning opportunity. I don't think that their fees are really that high. There's a very generous referral program, as we already touched upon. And you also get 10,000 Satoshi when they are mining 5,000 Satoshi. That's not really that much. And your friend also gets 10,000 Satoshi when they do that. So um, make sure to ref go through my referral link. Otherwise, you won't get that 10K. And overall, it's... it's um. It's a nice, nice, you know, easy way to mine. And it's not really, you don't have to go to the hoops and everything. And it's relatively easy to understand and install. And you just only need to set up your Bitcoin account or Ravencoin account. And when you have enough money, bang, you withdraw. And it's easy as that. No hassling, no mumbo jumbo settings and things you have to do like with the other miners. This is very, very easy mining. <clears throat> if you have any questions about Kudo Miner, leave questions down below or go to their website. They have a fag section here where they pretty much explain all the other details, which I didn't mention on this video. I will see you guys soon. Cheers.